Hi, so in the previous tutorial we override our properties. So like we change sign in to login here. So look, this is sign in to login. So in this tutorial we change our module properties file or we can say module keys. So like let me just add some. So I add a message for portlet and now in this tutorial I change these keys. So these are module keys. So for this first we have to find out the language dot properties file of this message board portlet. So this file can be found in your source code IMPL SRC. and modules and then apps and then in collaboration so inside collaboration you can open message board and inside message board web you can open your language or properties so this is my language or properties so i need to change like this my post and this band user so search for the key So now I change this to like uh, my custom post and my custom brand users. So now I need to create a class. Let me just copy this. So here I need to define three properties. First the symbolic name of portlet so symbolic name of this message board portlet and property file path and servlet context name so
so i need to find the properties of these two so for this let me open my command prompt and search for message so now our id of live free message board web is 93 so i need to find out the detail about this live free message board web so for this i am using another command headers and pass the id so now our servlet context path is this so let me just copy this and paste inside this so now i need to find the symbolic name and this is my symbolic name so now our class implement interface resource bundle loader Add implemented method so for this I need to create a aggregate bundle loader So I just create a aggregate resource bundle object and initializes in this method. I import all the things and this is my my custom language class and at the reference tag contain the target which is exactly same as symbolic name. now our object is created i need to use this and that's it it's done now you can deploy your module and check the output So now our module is started. So refresh the page. And look, this is now my custom post and my custom brand user. So we successfully changed the keys of our modules. So if you like the video, you can hit the like button, share the video and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.